I'm Tom from DIY Life Tech, and this is a look at how to manually set your Google Nest thermostat. So we all know the Nest thermostat is able to automatically set itself, but you can also manually set a temperature if you don't like the temperature in the house. It's very simple. We're just gonna take the actual dial here, and we're just gonna spin it to set the temperature that we want. So it's at 72. I can change it, I can make it 70, I can make it higher if I want to. You can see the heat will come on or off depending on the temperature that I set it to. And again, we're just twisting the outside of that dial to select our desired temperature. Now we can also switch the mode. Right now we're on heat, but if your system supports it, just press the dial in, and then we're gonna just turn it and go to mode. Again, press to select. We can go to cool if we wanna switch over to air conditioning, and then we can set whatever temperature we want. Now, one thing that can be a little bit confusing is that once you set a temperature, sometimes you'll come back later and it'll be different. Um, and that's because the, the thermostat is actually learning based on the changes you make. So if you consistently change the temperature at a certain time of day, it'll kind of program itself, which is great, but sometimes you don't want that. So what you can do is actually press in, again, to get back to that main menu. We're gonna go over to the schedule and then it's gonna show us what the upcoming temperature changes are. There's a bunch of them, as you can see. So, you know, right now it's gonna stay at whatever temperature I set it to, but then it's gonna, at one o'clock, go to 68 degrees. So if I don't want it to do that, I can go ahead and delete these uh, future changes. I just kind of go over them until it's selected, press that in, go to remove, or I can change them if I want. Maybe I want it to be at 74 instead of 75. I can say change, just move that around in the terms of the positioning, and then press again, and we can move it up and down. I'll make it that 74 that I want it to be. So that's the trick is, at first just set it, and when we're done, we scroll all the way back, and we're good, back on the main thing. So yep, turn the dial to select your uh, desired temperature, but just make sure to check that schedule setting to see if it's gonna change it in the future. If you like those changes, great. If not, you can always remove or alter the future changes on that thermostat.